Are you aware that the wingtips of an airplane have blinking lights? In this video, we will teach you how to create a GIF using Microsoft PowerPoint for this one second blink cycle. If you look at the timing carefully, it's just basically a one second blink cycle that repeats indefinitely. If you are new to this channel, just hit the subscribe button for free. Airplanes have eight types of lights. Logo, wing inspection, anti-collision lights, position or navigation lights, alternating landing light system, landing, anti-collision, specifically beacon, because they're color red instead of white, and runway turn off with taxi lights. For this demonstration of blinking lights, we will just only mention two types of lights. Those blinking lights are specifically called anti-collision white lights. They're mounted at the wings and at the tail. The other type of blinking light is called a beacon. They're mounted on top and below the airplane, in the middle of the fuselage. Here's what a one second blink looks like on an Airbus 320 plane. For the first 50 milliseconds, the wing and tail strobe lights are turned on simultaneously. After 50 milliseconds, the wing lights are turned off momentarily leaving the tail strobe light only turned on. In the next 50 milliseconds, the tail strobe light turns off and then the wing strobe lights turn on again. Then there will be no blinking lights for 350 milliseconds, leaving only the navigation lights that are green and red on the wing tips turned on steadily. Afterwards, the beacon lights on top and below the fuselage turn on for just 100 milliseconds. They are both color red on top and below the airplane. And once again, there will be no blinking lights, but this time, there will be an extra 50 milliseconds of no blink. It becomes 400 milliseconds from 350 after the beacon lights have been turned on very briefly. This is how the wing and tail strobe lights look like for 50 milliseconds. Very bright white lights, right? At the wing tips and at the tail. If only the tail strobe light is being turned on in white, the navigation lights at the wing tips become visible in green and red. If only the wing strobe lights are turned on, the wings illuminate in bright white a lot more than the tail. When there are no blinking lights, only the navigation lights that are steady red and green, as well as the white at the back, at the tail, will be visible to a spectator. Beacon lights are indicators on the airplane to tell the people that the jet engines on my airplane are turned on from the moment that the pilots start this jet engines individually. And once again, there will be no blinking lights for an extra 50 milliseconds after the beacons have turned on momentarily. Once we have created a slide, a motion picture slide, consisting of 20 slides in all. We will set up the show in PowerPoint by clicking on the upper left, Slide Show tab, and then select Set Up Slide Show down below. Then check Loop Continuously Until Escape, and then click OK on the pop-up box. And then back to the upper left, click File, and then select export in the drop down tab on the left side of the screen and then select create an animated gif 
for the highest quality we choose extra large among the drop down choices in the description the video quality and then there should be only 50 milliseconds to spend on each slide in other words 0 0.05 second 5% 5 of a second and then click create GIF in just a few seconds you will be able to have a GIF that demonstrates the blinking light cycle of an airplane every second and it's just a repeating cycle because GIF has no definite stop unless you close the image file and then we will save it as a GIF once you click create GIF then you choose your file name I suggest typing one second blink and then click save on the pop-up box we will now preview the one second blink as you can see here, the cycle of blinking lights is just repetitive in a one second cycle. I hope you find this video amusing to look at as I create a GIF about blinking airplane lights at the wings and at the tail.